And so, in something very interesting, it kind of seems like there might be an issue between Zuji Kok Dope and his label, Stay Low, because you guys will still remember that. He posted a video and announced that he signed to this unknown label at the time called Stay Low, of which a lot of us now know about it because of him and signings like Pretty Ugly. And now on Twitter, he came out to say that, imagine trying to make someone's life difficult just because they don't want to work with you anymore. That's really some whole shit, dog, and you know it. I met a lot of weirdos in my life, but you identify top one, bro. Watch him run to his boss about these tweets. These are the things I get. Whole shit. Also, at this time, you know, a lot of tweets have been deleted, including this one, so it kind of seems like he did actually run to his boss. And he did say that the biggest artist on their roster, that is, I'm assuming him, Imagine leaving a company and wanting to leave a deal and people start acting like some hoes, doing everything just to spite you when they should just let you go. Like yes, that's why people like us shouldn't work together. Look at how you're acting. Yeah, ne, star V, you're a hoe bro damn. And now I actually don't know who V is but I'm assuming he's that white guy, Vaughn or something like that. And lastly he said that the truth will always prevail little homie, you can't control the narratives forever. And you know, I just don't know man, when it comes to artists and labels, you know, Zuchiko Dope mentions wanting to leave a deal, but in as far as a lot of deals are concerned, you usually can't just wake up and decide, hey, I want to leave the deal. But you know, apart from this deal that I know nothing about, I kind of also questioned why, you know, the likes of Zuchi and Pretty signed with this stay low because I haven't seen anything happen for these guys ever since they signed. And also, this label was unknown. We only knew about it, you know, after those signings. And I just kind of questioned like whether or not it was actually necessary for guys like Pretty and Zuchi, who already had their own fan bases to like sign deals with like record labels like that. But I don't know man, you guys tell me what you think about it, comment down below, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and please do not forget to subscribe for more updates on your favorite celebrities.